there is no end to the strange discoveries that space has in store for researchers and regular people alike. From potential indicators of alien civilizations to front row seats to watch intergalactic consumption unfold, it seems that every day there are new mysteries uncovered and new questions to be answered. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we will be looking at three recent space discoveries. Missing stars could point to alien civilizations. Researchers comparing views of the Lupus the Wolf constellation taken in 1950 and then again in 2016 noticed that a star was missing. This alone is nothing incredibly mysterious, but subsequent studies noted that this single disappearing star was not alone. There were in fact hundreds of unaccounted for stars that have disappeared over the decades, with apparently no explanation. A new study has been published in the Astronomical Journal that attempts to understand how so many stars could just disappear without a trace, and the implications are astonishing. Led by Beatrice Villarol, the authors state in the report that unless a star directly collapses into a black hole, there is no known physical process by which it could physically vanish. The implications of finding such objects extend from the traditional astrophysics field to the more exotic searches for evidence of technologically advanced civilizations. Essentially, the authors believe that one of the clearest explanations for the disappearing stars is the involvement of extraterrestrial life. They have identified so-called hotspots, where there seem to be a surprising number of missing stars, and believe that homing in on these locations for further study and analysis could be a way to target potential locations of extraterrestrial life. Many researchers believe that, if advanced alien civilizations were to exist, they would have likely developed what is hypothetically known as a Dyson Sphere. This megastructure would allow the civilization to encompass a star to harness the reactions occurring on this star for energy, and the researchers conducting this study acknowledge that this could be a possible reason for hundreds of stars to disappear so suddenly. However, researchers are hesitant to acknowledge theories such as this, especially given the frequency with which proposed extraterrestrial activity has turned out to have a much more natural explanation. But, even if the disappearance of the stars had nothing to do with aliens, finding out what natural occurrence caused them to blink out of view would still be a huge step for researchers. Villarol noted that finding an actually vanishing star or a star that appears out of nowhere would be a precious discovery and certainly would include new astrophysics beyond the one we know of today. So for now, researchers are continuing to probe the circumstances of this disappearance in the hopes that they either locate extraterrestrial life or uncover groundbreaking previously unknown principles of astrophysics. Mysterious giant bubbles discovered at the center of the Milky Way There are many things that could be lurking unseen at the center of our Milky Way, so researchers are always prepared for new discoveries, but what they did not expect to find were mysterious bubbles. However, these were not the soap bubbles that children blow on Earth. This was a pair of enormous radio-emitting bubble-like structures that have been hiding in plain view right at the center of our galaxy. The two orbs are stacked on top of each other in such a way that they form a massive structure vaguely resembling an hourglass hanging at the heart of the Milky Way. In fact, they are so huge that they far surpass all other structures in the region, with each one measuring hundreds of light years in diameter. But what are they, and how could such large objects have been hiding in plain sight for all this time? Researchers were able to detect the strange bubbles at long last due to the radio waves they are emitting, which were picked up by a team using the South African Radio Astronomy Observatory Meerkat Telescope, which is the largest science project in Africa. The bubbles had previously been hidden due to the overpowering nature of the radio emissions that already come from the center of the galaxy, but the powerful capabilities of the Meerkat allowed researchers to filter through the dense radio dust in order to get a much clearer image of what can be found at the center of the Milky Way. They believe that such strange structures may be several million years old and might have appeared as the result of a powerful energetic burst 
occurring in the vicinity of the supermassive black hole that rests at the centre of the Milky Way. Ian Hayward, lead author of the study, described these strange findings, stating, The centre of our galaxy is relatively calm when compared to other galaxies, with very active central black holes. Even so, the Milky Way's central black hole can, from time to time, become uncharacteristically active, flaring up as it periodically devours massive clumps of dust and gas. It's possible that one such feeding frenzy triggered powerful outbursts that inflated this previously unseen feature. This area around the Milky Way's centre has always been one of the most mysterious aspects of our galaxy due to the unusual amount of activity that occurs there, fueled by the black hole that drives many energetic processes within this region of the galaxy. Discovering elements of what lies within this strange, uncharted space can help researchers as they begin to pass through what exactly occurs at this point of the Milky Way. Although there are not many immediately forthcoming answers confirming how two such strange, enormous radio-emitting bubbles appeared, simply discovering their presence is enough to give researchers plenty of information to add to the growing body of theories surrounding the behaviours at the centre of our galaxy. Little Cub Gives Astronomers Rare Chance to See Galaxy Demise Recently, astronomers spotted a small galaxy in its last throats of life, as it was consumed by a much larger neighbouring galaxy. The small galaxy, which is located within the Ursa Major constellation, is being absorbed by the gigantic spiral galaxy NGC 3359. The larger galaxy is stripping the smaller galaxy of the gases that it needs to continue to form stars. Although the galaxies are two to three hundred thousand light years apart, this is close enough for the larger galaxy, which contains almost ten thousand times the number of stars of Little Cub, to exert its effect upon the smaller galaxy and begin to absorb the gases that are vital for its continued existence. Lead author of the resultant study, Tiffany Su, a graduate student in the Department of Astronomy and Astrophysics at UC Santa Cruz, said that we may be witnessing the quenching of a near-pristine galaxy as it makes its first passage about a Milky Way-like galaxy. It is rare for such a tiny galaxy to still contain gas and be forming stars when it is in such close proximity to a much larger galaxy, so this is a great opportunity to see just how this process works. Essentially, the larger galaxy is removing the fuel that the little cub needs to form stars, which will eventually shut down star formation and lead to the smaller galaxy's demise. Because the demise of galaxies is so mysterious and hard to spot, having front row seats to the slow consumption of the little cub galaxy can hopefully help to dispel some of this mystery. But researchers are not just excited to analyse little cub's passing in order to study how a galaxy comes to an end. They are also curious to see what might lie within the galaxy as the gases that power it are siphoned off into the much larger neighbour. Little Cub has remained pristine and likely untouched since its initial formation, and astronomers are curious to study the elements within, which could reveal a great deal about what the chemical signature of the universe resembled during and immediately after the Big Bang, specifically regarding hydrogen and helium atoms. Measuring the relative number of these key atoms could tell researchers a great deal about the elemental makeup of the early universe, which could shed some light on the enduring question of how did the Big Bang occur. Although this is an incredibly slow process, and we will never even come close to seeing the final demise of the Little Cub Galaxy in our lifetime, even being able to glimpse a part of the process and its implications is huge for the field of astronomy. Hopefully, continued study will be able to shed some light on the intricacies of galactic interactions as well as the potential chemical makeup of the universe just moments after the Big Bang. But what do you make of these new discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comments section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.